What is your biggest phobia? Is it ghosts, murders, darkness, blood, haunted things, paranormal phenomena, or entities that you're dealing with? If that's the case, you've come to the correct spot. This article contains a list of spooky and frightening websites found on the internet. You've arrived because you requested it. But this is only the beginning. You still have time to flee. Will you go all the way or will you back out? I'll give you a heads up right now, some, or possibly most, of the websites on this page are not for the faint of heart. Re you all set? Let's begin your terrifying adventure through terrifying, really unpleasant websites that will terrify you. Websites, websites that, that are creepy and disturbing, disturbing that will give you the scare of your life. 1. Creepypasta. This is only the beginning, if you visit this site, you will be horrified. You have a refuge full of creepy stories and secrets with Creepypasta. I'm not sure why it's named Creepypasta, but it certainly is. In my perspective, the name is both blood-curdling and humorous. After all, it's intended to be a terrifying place with terrifying stories and articles. With a strange name like that, Creepypasta could simply bind you in the bosom of darkness with its endless spaghetti threats. 2. White Enamel Enamel in white. What the hell? White Enamel is a fun game to play. Perhaps it's a short film, a film with which you can engage. In reality, it's both. And it's strange and unsettling. White Enamel is a disturbing game in terms of involvement and playability. It has an unsettling atmosphere and is weird and disturbing. Enamel, white what's going on? White Enamel is a game that you may play with your friends. Maybe it's a short film, a film in which you may participate. Both. It's also strange and unsettling. White Enamel is a disturbing experience in terms of participation and gameplay. It's eerie and disturbing. The Outbreak Zombies, zombies, and more zombies. They're all over. However, in this game, your survival is contingent on your choices. The Outbreak is a multiplayer zombie survival game that may be played individually or in groups. Of course, zombies are the story's major obstacle, and whether you survive or not is up to you. To be honest, this isn't that frightening, but the creators should be commended for their efforts. This game isn't a waste of time, believe me. Bong Chung Dong Ghost Now is the time to turn around, before it's too late. Because once you get at this website and begin scrolling through the pages, anxiety may take over, or worsen. Bong Chung Dong Ghost is a webcomic about horror. It's a short yet satisfyingly gruesome webcomic. Notice how the word ghost appears in the title? That's because it's about a ghost, after all. I'm not going to give anything away since you have to find out for yourself. It's now up to you whether you learn things the easy or hard way. Just don't blame me if things get a little out of hand later on, okay? Marble Hornets Marble Hornets is a web series comprised of various video clips chronicling Jay's truth-seeking travels. It is a chronicle, a video chronology revealing the enigma of the paranoia-inducing Slender Man. It all began with a school project called Marble Hornets, and now Jay is on his journey to uncovering the unmistakable truth. This is terrifying. Don't blame me for the horrors that await you if you decide to pursue the plot and go deeper into the web of evil. The Scary Maze Game Have you ever played the terrifying Scary Maze game? I'm quite sure you already did. After all, it's one of the greatest classic fright pranks ever devised in human history. The Scary Maze game may appear to be a simple maze game, but it has a sinister twist. You'll be surprised if you concentrate long enough and get to the last step, the third stage. That is, if you understand what I mean. If you play this game, or have already played it, you'll understand why it's one of the most terrifying games ever developed. 973 Eth Namu First and foremost, who the heck designed this site? It's completely illogical. Why is it even a thing? For what reason? 973 Eth Namu is a pretty strange and bizarre website. Everything about it is illogical. I have no idea what went through its creator's mind. One thing is certain, human the 370 is 973 Eth Namu backward. That still doesn't make sense, but progress is being made. But that's not it. There are plenty more of these strange occurrences. This website is very bizarre, with bizarre images, frightening language, and strange handwriting. Purgatorium Purgatorium is a game that appears to take place within purgatory, as awful as that sounds. Purgatorium is the result of this. 
It's a horror game with a short length. You roam about within a room and discover every nook and corner in this game. Every element is unsettling, as if things are about to take a sinister turn. Yes, it does. The conclusion is ominous. I'm not sure whether you'll make it to the conclusion, but trust me, it'll be worth it. The Deep Web So you believe you've seen all there is to see on the internet? Well, you're completely wrong. Everything you've seen thus far on the internet is only the beginning. Everything on the internet is a minor part of it, from search engines to the results they provide. The deep web comprises not just the totality of the internet, but also dodgy material that you wouldn't believe you could fathom. T is possible to see it using a special browser, but the question is whether you really want to see it. Are you completely ready to go deeper? The contents of the deep web, however, may leave you scarred for life. 99 Rooms The game 99 Rooms is another strange and bizarre game. 99 Rooms is a game in which you go through 99 distinct rooms with no particular aim or objective in mind. All you have to do is go to each one and see how quickly you can get to the next. You would think that's nonsense, yet these 99 rooms aren't like any other. All of the chambers are creepy and packed with strange objects. Every single room is a complete disaster. The rooms will not make you leap in fright or make you break out in cold sweats, but they will make you feel uneasy and creeped out. Sachiko Ever After this Sachiko Ever After charm is from the Corpse Party series, which you may have seen if you're an anime or manga fan. Sachiko Ever After is a friendship bracelet that lasts a lifetime. That may appear to be a wonderful thing, but if everyone is clueless about what they're doing, the charm might quickly turn into a curse. The people who performed the Sachiko Ever After ritual were truly eternally together in the series plot. However, the location where they all met was not as they had envisioned. They were all in the same place. In hell. Rate my poop. How would you rate my poop? You, that already sounds revolting. As you may be aware, disgusting may also mean frightening. They are definitely frightening up close and personal when it comes to excrement and other filthy stuff. Rate my poo is a subreddit, a reddit.com community, where you can upload photos of your feces and rate different types of poo. The scale runs from 1 to 10, depending on your preferences. That is, assuming you are able to rate the poos without becoming green and horrified. I can't even force myself to rate anything since one glance makes me feel sick. After all, seeing unpleasant things is a terrifying experience. Hotel 626 First and foremost, I regret to inform you that Hotel 626 is no longer in operation. It was taken down for no apparent reason. It's now little more than a gilded relic from the past. But who knows if it will ever be realized. Hotel 626 was a terrifying experience. It used to be that it could only be played after 6 p.m. It used to be open until 6 a.m., but it no longer exists. The 626 in its name refers to the time range in which it may be performed. Oh, and it's nighttime. You'd know how terrifying it was if you'd played it before. It was really well made and terrifyingly frightening. It was an unusual find, especially at the time. Back then, who would have guessed it existed? All you can do now is read about it and watch films about it. Thanks for watching the top.